the internet, their website. I saw one of them 18 wheelers out there in Los Angeles, so I said, so I decided to you know, get on the web, website right there. Yeah, and then I was reading about the company and you know, said I go with them. I heard it's a good company, you know. No. No, I didn't. Um, I was trying to get my license. I got my license, my CDL. I was a warehouseman, you know. I worked for Budweiser for 10 years in a warehouse. You know, loading trucks, all that. But my mind was always, you know, leveraging the trucks, you know. So that was my thing, always trying to be a truck driver. They're supportive, you know. They want me to go ahead and do it because they know that was my thing I always wanted to do, so. Yeah, it is, you know, kids, you know, that's that's very hard on the kids, the kids part, you know, that's very hard, because they're still kind of small. The oldest was 12, the oldest 10, but, you know, as long as I email them every day, or get a chance to talk to them, that's good. So far, the best part, learning new things every day. That's, you know, getting all the information, that's probably the best. Learning from different instructors, you know, that's, I just sucking in all the information so I could be a, a good driver. I was just thinking, here's your information, you're screwing, you know, but no. You know, they go beyond what, you, what they're supposed to, I think. You know, they go beyond to help you out. You got questions, they, you know. Hardest thing was probably the road, you know, the road thing, because you get nerves, you know what I mean? You're, you're nervous, but once you get past that, I think you'll be good. Like I said, you know, it's hard. You know, when you miss, you know what I mean? You miss, of course you're gonna miss family. You cannot say you, you don't miss them. Of course, you know, you miss them. They know I gotta do this, you know, to help them out, you know, the kids in the future, you know, get back on my two feet. I always wanted to be a truck driver since I was like seven years old, I believe. I always wanted to do it, you know, I, and then when I started working for Budweiser, I started learning how to drive the trucks in the parking lot. So I go, this ain't so bad. But I would never take a test because I had to do a pre trip, and I was always scared of pre trips because I can't really memorize stuff. But once I got that out of the way, you know. Man, that's what I always want to be a truck driver then to get to travel the states, get to see the things I want to, see, you know, things I want to see before I die. Grand Canyon, you know, and so forth, so forth. Just that truck just got in, you know, made me want to be a truck driver. The size of the truck, the power, you know, I was like, man, you know, yeah, that'd be nice, you know, being a truck driver. For me, to be a professional truck driver, that's my goal, to be professional have no accidents, be real safe. You know, that's my number one thing always in any job I do. Safety is first. I don't care if you say, oh, you're a little slow, slow you know. As long as I'm safe, you know, no accidents, I'm, that's good for me. The instructors are really good here. Yeah. Everybody here, everybody in the system is real good. You know, like I said, the hospitality here, it's real, that's one big thing here. You know, they'll go out of their way, I believe, you know what I mean? To, you know, students who go out of their way to help you out, and that's really good and meeting all these people here, all the other students.